Und damit, Kevin, Leute, was geht ab? Und herzlich willkommen zu einer neuen Folge von Rocket League. Wenn ihr die letzte Folge verpasst habt und keine Ahnung habe, über was ich hier gerade rede, schaut euch die letzte Folge an. War zu witzig und herzlich. Willkommen jetzt, hier, jetzt, genau jetzt. Jetzt, jeden Moment, genau jetzt. Drück zum Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Let's. Sollen wir nochmal warten? Ne, let's go. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Ich geh jetzt zurück. I can't. Okay. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his co-workers. Oh, nix. Alles bisschen seltsam hier. Können sie noch wirklich zu? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Ja, ja klar. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it ja, perfectly well. Genau. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Wow. Um. Yes, this room. But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Wie gehen wir hier lang? Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. Ja. Das war das ein Ende? Okay, wir haben Ende erreicht. Es ist, ist ein Ende. Ähm, um, ja. Dann haben wir ein Ende erreicht. Ich wollte das nämlich unbedingt ausprobieren. Denn das steht nämlich da, nicht runterspringen. Und ich dachte mir schon, irgendwas muss ja passieren. Einfach tot. Stanley took the first open door on his left. Nee, heute nicht, mein Freund. Ich kann die Türen zu. Das heißt, ich kann auch safe Türen aufmachen. Stanley was so bad at following directions. It's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Geht's mal ganz normal der Story weiter. Look Stanley, I think perhaps we've got Aber man muss irgendwie nach hier unten kommen. Just because da unten ist eine Tür. Da sind wir ja beim letzten Mal lang gegangen und sind zu Rocket League gekommen. Wir sind ja hier runtergegangen. To let her back into your life. She's been waiting. Ja, ich fahre jetzt mit dem Gabelstapler weg. Ich kann da sogar ein Stückchen. Ja, ich gehe da mal da rein. That's her, Stanley. You need to be the one to do this. To reach out to her. If you can truly place your faith in another, then pick up the phone. Nee. Kabel ist ein bisschen... Boah, die Schatten sind ja mal ultimativ schlecht getextet. Muss abnehmen. Looks like. Konnte keine andere Decision jetzt machen. Sweetie, sorry to keep you waiting. I'm just pulling the bread out of the oven. All right. Okay, there we go. All right, now, I want you to come in and tell me all about... Get your day boy. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on. Did you actually think you had a loving wife? Who'd want to commit their life to you? I'm trying to make a point here, Stanley. I'm trying to get you to see something. Come inside. Let me show you what's... 
Es tut mir leid. Dass ich auch nur das immer. Richtig? Nein. Ähm, ich habe keine Ahnung, wie, warum oder was die gerade von mir wollen. Wir haben jetzt. Really going on here. Ja, nicht blöd und geht ab. Sorry, but you're in my story now. Then This is a very sad story about the death of a man named Stanley. Stanley is quite a boring fellow. He has a job that demands nothing of him. And every button that he pushes is a reminder of the inconsequential nature of his existence. Ypsilon N. Look at him there, pushing buttons, doing exactly what he's told to do. Now he's pushing a button. Now he's eating lunch. Now he's going home. Now he's coming back to work. One might even feel sorry for him, except that he's chosen this life. F. Ah, man wird gezwungen, also ich kann nichts anderes machen. But in his mind, ah, in his mind he can go on fantastic adventures. From behind his desk, Stanley dreamed of wild expeditions ja, into the unknown. Ja, natürlich. Fantastic discoveries of new lands. Ja, was denn sonst? Ich kann ja so... And each day that he returned to work, Natürlich träume ich davon, wenn ich den ganzen Tag im Büro sitze, Langeweile habe. Ich habe keine Ahnung, wie das funktioniert. 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 Ich habe keine Ahnung, wie das So, he went further. He imagined that he came to two open doors and that he could go through either. At last, choice. It barely even mattered what lay behind each door. Ja, the mere thought that his decisions would mean something was almost too wonderful to behold. As he wandered through this fantasy world, he began to fill it with many possible paths and destinations. Down one path lay an enormous round room with monitors and mind controls. And down another was a yellow line that weaved in many directions. And das ist einfach das, was in der ersten Folge passiert ist, Leute. Ey, ihr versteht gar nichts. Ihr müsst euch ja... Ich dachte immer so, ja, unabhängige, verschiedene Enden so. Ihr müsst euch ja legit jede Folge anschauen, damit ihr das hier versteht. Ah. Erstmal die Glücks machen hier. Diese gelbe Linie ist. Oh. Da sind wir so lang gelaufen und dann. Ja, und dann war da unten so ein Spiel mit einem Baby, ja. Da war dann unten, ihr glaubt es nicht, da war unten. Oh mein Gott, diese Linie. Die sollten wir uns auch merken. Wegen dem Punkt wahrscheinlich. Oh mein Gott, wir sind in der Story weiter. It was good. such a wonderful fantasy, and so in his head, he relived it again, and then again, and again, over and over, wishing beyond hope that it would never end, that he might always feel this free. Surely there's an answer down some new path, mustn't there be? Perhaps if he played just one more time. Dich. But there is no answer. How could they possibly wir bauen unser Office und wenn es fertig ist, ist, sind wir wieder am Start des Spiels. Er always has. Nothing has changed. The longer he spends here, the more invested he gets, the more he forgets which life is the real one. And I'm trying to tell him this, that in this world he can never yeah, be Wisst ihr, was ich meine? Also wir haben jetzt hier schon mal so ein bisschen und hier wir bauen einfach unser Büro wieder hier in unserem Haus. But he won't listen to me. He won't stop. Here, watch this. Stanley, 
The next time the screen asks you to push a button, do not do it. You see? Can he just not hear me? How can I tell him in a way? Das war gescriptet, dass ich drück. Das war umgedrehte Psychologie. Das war umgedrehte Psychologie. Das war Understand that every second he remains here, he's electing to kill himself. How can I get him to see what I see? How can I make him look at himself? Gar nichts jetzt. Ah. Dazu? I suppose I can't. Not in the way I want him to. But I don't make the rules. I simply play to my intended purpose. The same as Stanley. We're not so different, I suppose. I'll try once more to convey all this to him. I'm compelled to. I must. Perhaps. Well, maybe this time. Ja? We'll see. Was soll ich tun? Maybe this time. And I tried again. And Stanley pushed a button. And I tried again. And Stanley pushed a button. And I tried. Dieses Spiel ist alles, was man an Witz in seinem Leben braucht. Someone was following Stanley. He was sure of it. If he checked over his shoulder now, he would surely catch them. It was only a matter of time. Dies keine Jumps I'm safe is safe. Unangenehm. Don't want new content. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Ja, klar. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Standing now in the but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Yeah. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Hoping he might find an answer there. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs ja. to his boss's office. Als ob! Money in the morning, money in the evening, money for breakfast, money crisp. Okay. Den Spiegel gucken. <lacht> Go. Okay. Business strategy. Business strategy. Äh, nach oben. Okay. Ich kann nicht mehr raus. Ich wollte jetzt versuchen rauszurennen und gucken, ob der Aufzug auch ohne mich fährt. Aber anscheinend nicht. Ja, dann trinken wir doch erstmal einen Schluck. Wenn wir jetzt wieder an der gleichen Stelle rauskommen, gehe ich ganz normal den Weg. Ich habe mir halt nicht den Code gemerkt von dem Safe. Stepping into his manager's office, Stanley was once again stunned to discover not an indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this, what dark secret was being held from him. What he could not have known 
was that the keypad behind the boss's desk guarded the terrible truth that his boss had been keeping from him. And so the boss had assigned it an extra secret pin number, 2845. But of course, Stanley couldn't possibly have known this. Two, eight, four, five. We're going to go to the By simply pushing random buttons on the keypad, Stanley happened to input the correct code by sheer luck. Amazing. He stepped into the newly Guck opened mal. passageway. Wirklich zu? Um. Ja, wir gehen wieder runter. Ganz normal, so wie beim letzten Mal auch. Und unten machen wir dann ein paar andere Entscheidungen. Nur dann gehen wir natürlich in den New Content noch. Loading. 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 Descending deeper into the building. Stanley realized he felt a bit peculiar. It was a stirring of emotion in his chest, as though he felt more free to think for himself, to question the nature of his job. Why did he feel this now, when for years it had never occurred to him? This question would not go unanswered for long. Can we go up? Stanley walked straight ahead through the large door that read Mind Control Facility. Hey, I don't go that long. I'm about to escape to the one place that hasn't been corrupted by capitalism. Space. Keep written on it. The truth was that at the end of this hall, Stanley would be dead. Too scary. Einfach ein klasse Typ. The door behind him was not shut. Stanley still had every opportunity to turn around and get back on track. Eh, keine Lust. At this point, Stanley was making a conscious, concerted effort to walk forward and willingly confront his death. Nee, wir gehen weiter. Lass einfach mal weitergehen. Wir können jetzt wieder zurückdrehen, weil er sagt ja, wir sollen weitergehen, wir könnten zurückgehen. Uh, hier ist unser Dev. So. Dann schönen Tag noch. Wir gehen doch nicht da lang. Wir gehen wieder zurück. Mal gucken, ob das irgendeine besondere Auswirkung aufs zukünftige Gameplay hat oder so. Ich weiß es ja nicht. Man muss ja immer mal gucken hier. Vor allen Dingen, warum läuft Stanley schief? Das ist weird. Stanley thought better of it and realized he simply had too much to live for. Ja. Aber wir machen diesmal die Mind Controlling Maschine an. The lights rose on an enormous room packed with television screens. What horrible secret did this place hold? Stanley thought to himself. Did he have the strength to find out? Zurückgehen können wir nicht. Wir waren hier schon mal, ich glaube, in der ersten Folge. Ich weiß es nicht. Now the monitors jump to life. Their true nature revealed. Da sind wir. Each bore the number of an employee in the building. Genau. Stanley's co-workers. The lives of so many individuals reduced to images on a screen. And Stanley, one of them, eternally monitored in this place where freedom meant nothing. Hello? This mind control facility. It was too horrible to believe. It couldn't be true. Ich weiß es nicht. Also ich weiß nicht genau, wie ich mich jetzt dazu einstellen soll. Was this the only reason he was happy with his boring job? That his emotions had been manipulated to accept it blindly? Der Knopf ist weird. No. He refused to believe it. He couldn't accept it. His own life. His own life. In someone else's control. Never. It was unthinkable, wasn't it? Was it even possible? Had he truly spent his entire life utterly blind to the world? Can't be. But here was the proof. The heart of the operation. 
Controls labeled with emotions. Happy or sad hey, hier immer noch nicht or hoch. content. Walking, eating, working. All of it monitored and commanded from this very place. And as the cold reality of his past began to sink in, Stanley decided that this cold? machinery would never again exert its terrible power over another human life. For he would dismantle the controls once and for yep. all. Hier passiert auch nichts. Ähm, also hier sind ultra viele Farben. Ich bin mir sicher, die muss man in einer bestimmten Kombination drücken. Aber ich weiß es nicht. Was steht eigentlich hier? Och, ich weiß gar nicht. Könnt ihr das lesen überhaupt von hier? Ich kann es auch nicht lesen, dann ist okay. Und wenn er last he found the source of the room. Oh, Stanley. You didn't just activate the controls, did you? After they kept you enslaved all these years, you go and you try to take control of the machine ja. yourself. Is that what you wanted? Control? Oh, Stanley. I applaud your effort, I really do. But you need to understand, there's only so much that machine can do. You were supposed to let it go. Turn the controls off and leave. If you want to throw my story off track, you're going to have to do much better than that. I'm afraid you don't have nearly the power you think you do. For example, and I believe you'll find this pertinent, Stanley suddenly realized he had just initiated the network's emergency detonation system. In the event that this machine is activated without proper DNA identification, nuclear detonators are set to explode, eliminating the entire complex. How long until detonation then? Mm, let's say, um, two minutes. Ah, now this is making things a little more fun, isn't it, Stanley? It's your time to shine. You are the star. It's your story now. Shape it to your heart's desires. Oh, this is much better than what I had in mind. What a shame we have so little time left to enjoy. Das ist offen. Mere moments until the bomb goes okay. off. But what precious Eins, moments each one of them is. Zwei. More time lauf, 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 lauf. Wir haben genau zwei Minuten, Leute. Where we're going. What all this means. I barely know where to start. Drei. Da hoch ist vier, das What's wissen that? wir schon. You'd like to know where your co-workers are. Ja. A moment of solace before you're obliterated. All right, I'm in a good mood. You're gonna die anyway. I'll tell you exactly yeah. what happened to them. I erased them. What? I turned off the machine. I set you free. Of course, that was merely in this instance of the story. Sometimes when I tell it, I simply let you sit there in your office forever, pushing buttons endlessly and then dying alone. Other times, I let the office sink into the ground, noch irgendwo einer? swallowing everyone inside, or I let it burn to a crisp. Oder der hier. I have to say this though, this version of events has been rather amusing. Ich habe alle Knöpfe gedrückt. Da hinten ist ein Ausgang. Oh mein Gott, der hat sich wahrscheinlich gerade geöffnet, oder bin ich einfach nur doof dran vorbeigelaufen? But I'm sure whatever I come up with on the next go around will be even better. My goodness, only 34 seconds left. But I'm enjoying this so much. You know what? To hell with it. I'm going to put some extra time on the clock. Why not? These are precious additional seconds, Stanley. Time doesn't grow on trees. Oh dear me, what's the matter, Stanley? Is it that you have no idea where you're going or what you're supposed to be doing right now? Or did you just assume when you saw that timer that something in this room was capable of turning it off? I mean, look at you. Running from button to button, screen to screen, clicking on every little thing in this room. These numbered buttons, no, these colored ones, or maybe this big red button, or this door. No. Everything, anything, something here will save me. Why would you think that, Stanley? That this video game can be beaten? This is ten. Solved? Do you have any idea? Oh my God! Hör doch auf. <laughs> Stanley. You're in for quite a disappointment. Zehn, wo ist denn die drei? That timer isn't a catalyst to keep the action moving along. It's just seconds ticking away to your death. You're only still playing instead of watching a cutscene because I want to watch you for every moment that you're powerless. To see you made humble. This is not a challenge. It's a tragedy. You wanted to control this world, that's fine. But I'm going to destroy it first. So Nein! you can't. Take a look at the clock, Stanley. Uh, That's yeah. 30 seconds you have left to struggle. 30 seconds until a big boom and then nothing. No ending here. Just you being blown to pieces. 
Vielleicht, ich probiere es nochmal. Eins. Zwei. Wir machen alle das falsche Geräusch. Oh mein Gott, wie das hier wackelt. Ich bin mir sicher, man kann da irgendwas machen. Ich glaube auch, dass die Story an einem gewissen Punkt einfach da weitergeht. Aber... All of his co-workers were gone. Ah, What did it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oh, new content? What Nein. does that mean? Man hätte nach new content. Können. Weiß ich nicht. Wir schauen uns das noch in der Folge an. Wir können es hier drin. Wir können nicht springen. Dementsprechend geht's straight up weiter. Ähm, wir sind eigentlich schon ziemlich am Ende Hello, der Folge. Thank you for playing the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. As you may know, the Stanley Parable was a video game released in 2013 on home computers. Ja. After receiving critical and commercial success, it was expanded upon in 2022 with the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, a reimagining of the game for consoles and home computers. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe features exciting new content that broadens and expands the world of the Stanley Parable, delighting ja. audiences the world over. Please, step inside and see what thrilling new adventures await in the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Okay. Oh, well, this sounds delightful. I'm very excited to see the thrilling new Ultra Deluxe content. Okay, so far it's an elevator. Nothing special. Ja, yet, das denke ich mal. Sure it's just the beginning of a mesmerizing adventure. Um is it broken? What's going on here? Should we should we be moving somewhere or uh, oh, yes. Ah, yes, okay, All perfect. Right, finally, at long last, it's on to the new content. I've never been ja. more ready. Let's do it. Ultra Deluxe Content, Leute. Jetzt abonnieren, damit ihr keine weiteren Folgen vom Ultra Deluxe Content mehr verpasst. Hmm. I have to say, initial impressions of Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Mostly tedious. It's as if them. Oh, okay. Let's see the content. Give me the content, Stanley. Ja, Content! Alright. Alright, let's see. It's. The Jump Circle? Wie gesagt, springen finde ich gut. Wir machen das jetzt mal kurz bis Null. Vielleicht gibt es dafür irgendwas Besonderes. Ja. War es dann wohl mit... Is, is that it? Surely that's not all the new content. There has to be something else, right? Ja, es geht immerhin weiter. I have to say, initial impressions of this game are not positive. Würde ich jetzt nicht sagen. Ja, wir können springen. Ja, springt. Das war das, was ich schon am ersten Tag gesagt habe. Wir müssen jumpen können. Ich kann dir die ganze Dictionary lesen. Es gibt 20 Hours von neuem Content direkt da. Hell, ich könnte 30 Trillionen zählen. Du könntest das auf die Box legen. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, now with over a thousand hours of new content. And if... Oh, wait. There's more. Very good. Yes. I knew there had to be something else. Let's see it. I'm ready for whatever it is. Tja, was auch immer das ist, was uns da als nächstes erwartet, muss leider in die nächste Folge. Denn, ja, Zeitprobleme. Wenn euch das ganz gefallen hat, gerne mit einer positiven Wertung. Und ich würde sagen, ohne groß zu reden, Schaut euch die nächste Folge an.